Today, I am here in Hello Kitty Cafe to be giving you guys a little bit of a tutorial on the Cinemoral Cloud Cafe mini game that just came out. This is a super fun mini game where you bake and you can make some coffees or some pastries or be a waiter. And a lot of people had some questions about how to play the mini game. So I will teach you guys what I know and how to play the mini game. So when you first join, if you do notice that the server is acting a little bit weird, it may be a glitched server. There's a few servers that aren't working and it's just a few of them. Most of the servers are working, but if you do notice that it's acting a little strange, then you may want to rejoin. First of all, of course, outside of the portal, you have the Cinema Rolls Exchange Store and this is where you're going to exchange those Cinema Roll coins. What are they called? I haven't looked at them yet. Oh, cinnamon coins! That is so cute! So that is where you exchange those if you are wondering about that. Today is the street lamp. I'm gonna buy one right now and I'm gonna take a quick look before we go and join because I haven't looked at it yet. Oh my gosh, it's so adorable! Oh, I'm so tempted to do an all cinema roll cafe theme. I think that'd be really cute. But that is the street lamp and I'm hoping to go live when it refreshes too or at least a video to show you guys what is in the shop. So let's head off to Simrol's Cloud Cafe you just walk into the portal and it'll teleport you to the mini game. Again, when you join the minigame, if you notice you can't see your cinema roll or that you can't do your job correctly, then you do want to rejoin. This is everything that we know of so far that's going to be in the exchange store. Panda Rock Games even gave me a little bit of tea and said that they're going to be adding more items. So just a little exciting news there. So this is not going to be everything in the store. If you walk in, you can go to the back to go and play the mini game. Okay, now you wanna go back to the staff room. You don't have to do this, but I think it's really cute. We'll start out with being a chef. So now, this is everything that you're gonna be using to make these items up on the board. Hello, pink twin. Looks like someone was able to join my server. But anyways, let's start out with something easy like this donut here. Hello to these people. Thank you for coming and saying hello. Okay, so let's go over here and get ourselves a sheet pan. This is the very first thing you're going to need is these sheet pans right here. So pick this up and then you want to go over to this dough over here where the pre-cooked counter is. And then I'm gonna grab myself a donut. But if you're going to bake other things, you have lots of other options. The only thing you're not gonna be baking is this pancake and toast. The other things you can bake, but not the toast and pancakes. And then you wanna take this donut, and if it doesn't have any other toppings on it, then you wanna just toss it in the oven. But this one right here has honey, so you would add honey to it and you would have to bake it together. So I'm gonna go over here and just toss it in here. This is another good example. Someone's cake is on fire, so we're gonna take the extinguisher, we're going to turn it on, and you just put it out, just like that. And then if you don't want it anymore, you can just toss it. Now let's take the donut out, and now it's all ready. So now you just wanna take it up to the serving window, and then you get some cinnamon roll coins or cinnamon coins for that. So now that is finished, let's try doing something a little more complicated. Let's try doing this one right here. So let's take a muffin from over here. And then we're going to grab some cinnamon and whipped cream. And that stuff is over here. The biggest part of all this is probably going to be memorizing where everything's at. But now I'm just going to take it down to the oven and bake it. And then you just wait for it to bake. If this isn't baking, you may have a glitch server. Um, that happened when I first was playing this minigame. But now we have a cinnamon shortcake and we're going to take it off to the serving window and 
send it off and get some more coins. So now let's do something on the stove. Let's go ahead and do a simple pancake. So now when you're doing something on the stove like a pancake or a toast, you're gonna grab the frying pan instead, go up to the dough still, and then pick out whatever you need. We are going to be doing a pancake, so I'm going to pick the pancakes. Next, we're going to bring it up to this stove, put it on, and let it cook up. Now it is all finished, and just like always, we're going to go and bring it to the serving window, and we're going to get some more coins for that. So now that we've done that, just like how you would do the muffin, if there is any other added things like this one, it's a little more complicated, let's do that one. We'll grab the frying pan, grab the pancake, we'll go ahead and grab the milk right there, which is over here. And then you also want to grab the decoration. So that is everything that we need, and then we're going to cook it up on the stove. Now we're going to take it off the stove and we're going to bring it back up to the serving window and we'll get some coins for that as well. So that is the baking part. Now let's make a drink. So there's multiple drinks. You have coffee, you have tea, and you have a milkshake. So, oh look, that's a perfect example. Let's pick up a mop. If you do see anything like this on the floor, you can mop it up. And now it is all put together and back so now I'm going to just throw it away because <laughs> I don't need it anymore. And then there's also water right here too. And some recipes do call for water. Let's do a coffee. So we're gonna take our coffee beans. This is everything you're gonna put in these guys. So if it's tea, you're grabbing the leaves. If it's a milkshake, you're gonna grab this. So now I'm gonna take this up to here. You're also going to need an empty cup as well. So that is located over by the pans. And you're gonna take this and bring it up to where you put your coffee beans. And then it's gonna make some coffee. Now, if it was just coffee, you would just bring it up to the serving window, but mine calls for some milk as well. So now, I'm going to go and grab some milk, which is back down here. Some coffee also calls for ice, and the ice is right there too. But now we're going to take it up to the serving window and get some coins. Let's do some water, since that one's a little more confusing. You're going to take your empty cup walk up to the water machine and get yourself some water this one calls for some honey and a lemon slice so let's add a lemon slice to it and then we'll go and add some honey to it and now it's honey lemonade and then we bring it up to the serving window so that is pretty much everything that you're going to be doing there um the only other things i haven't shown you is the tea the tea is pretty easy you just need a cup and the leaves bring it up to there and then if there's any other extras you just add them and all your extras are going to be here and if you need um, a milkshake you're going to take your fruit bring it up to the blender and then you're going to add in whatever else you need so now that you know how to do the baker job or the cooking job let's go and switch over to the waiter job so i'm going to switch my outfit here you don't really have to do that i just think it's cute and you're going to go and take these guys orders so we're going to take hello kitties and karopi's orders and you get some stuff for that but this is where you're gonna pick up what they ordered so this goes to Pachaco and Gudetama so we have to find Pachaco and Gudetama it looks like Pachaco is over here and then press F and Pachaco will eat it Gudetama is another option you can bring it to him as well so now we're gonna wait until they come back in take their order and then we'll pick it up from the pickup counter it's pretty easy for this one and it is a lot of fun i personally think the baking job is a little fun because you're constantly moving around here you kind of have to wait for these guys to walk back up let's take mama fubiori's order though sometimes it doesn't pop up so you kind of have to wait but now we got some toast here and we can bring it to Kuropi or I don't remember their name but let's bring it to the human anyways the human is down here so let's bring it to them and just like that we get some cinnamon coins 
So this mini game is a lot of fun. It is a good way to get all of these really cute items. I personally really love the wall and I really hope we can get it soon. I had a lot of fun playing this though and I will be playing it a lot more later. If you have any other questions, let me know down in the comments below and I will try to answer them as well as others. Let me know what you also think about this mini game in the comments below and thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye!